Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today I'm be doing another Game Maker Studio tutorial. Um, basically, I'm gonna show you. This is really great graphics, guys. So you're gonna see these graphics will be blown away. Sarcasm. Basically, I'm gonna show you how to make some uh, random objects that sort of uh, move randomly. So yes, that's what I'm doing. And you can make the green border around here like see-through if you want, or ma match the backgrounds. So you can just place it over the background. This is border is the only way I could figure it out, to be honest, to keep them contained. And I had it see-through, but at one point I was j demonstrating this to someone. Right, it's basically two objects, an object butterfly and an object wall. Your object butterfly, under its create event, you need to set alarm to 10, which means, um, basically, if you don't have this alarm, it's gonna look like the butterfly is glitching out or whatever object you have moved just is glitching so basically this is saying every number of steps well this bit is going to end up saying every ten steps it moves in a different direction so if you want it to stay following a certain direction for a longer time add a bigger number there um, and it says it goes to alarm zero alarm zero also says ten steps so and it sets a new direction of motion uh, random 360 which means random in any way at a speed of three so I did this all with code, and then if it goes to the wall, it reverses its direction because it's a butterfly. Uh, the butterfly is also solid and visible, but that's seriously it. And then that was a butterfly. So under the wall, that's still the butterfly. Under the wall, it's just a wall, it's just visible. That's it. And I just want to show you what happened. The first time I did this, I just had like basically set a random direction of motion, I think. I didn't have this. I'm just gonna see if this this is how it was before, because basically it took me 20 minutes to figure out this whole like alarm thing. I know that sounds really really stupid, especially for like the amount of time I've done stuff on Game Maker, but this like random 360. I got a speed of four. Oop! I don't need that. Basically, I had just this going, and it just looked awful. Uh, so I have more action in the creative event, but just trust me, this is the best way to do it. Um, I looked up several tutorials, and they basically made it look like they just spazzed out all the time, and I was so angry, and it took me forever to figure this out, and I was so angry when I figured it out, and was like, I'm stupid. So I just wanted to show it to you guys. So these have been like a bunch of really short little tutorials. I'm documenting everything. I got a new computer. So as always, uh, please like this video if you found it all useful. Comment if you have a question, and yeah, if you'd like to follow me on Twitch TV or... Uh, Twitter? Links in the description. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.